In April of last year, I investigated a confidential location with the Ghost Files, Paranormal Reality, Roku, and Frank Kirchie. That night, I was asked to do an hour-long isolation session in what staff called the Evil Basement. Today, a year later, I'm showing footage that I caught my camera for the very first time. I'm Alejandro. I search the world for paranormal activity. I am the Dead Explorer. Now staff reports that sometimes they see lights coming around here. Are you, any of you the lights, the staff sees the orbs? You think there's any way you can make yourself appear as a light? All right, what I'm gonna do next is start a new file on this and let's ask some questions. Maybe we can play a little game. Okay. I mean, there's just so much copper wiring, copper pipes, I mean, and wiring and insulation and water heaters. I mean, to me, this is just a typical basement. I'm starting a new session, okay? Five minutes. So if there's anybody down here, can you tell me what your name is? Is there a woman down here? Is there a man down here? That's an unusual sound. Was that you? Now, just to give you an idea of how hard a no flashlight isolation service is in this basement, there's just bricks sticking out of the ground. There's just stuff hanging off the ceiling. There's this huge hole in the ground, as you can see, maybe a couple feet across for me to walk through. I'm gonna lean against this pole right here. You're more than welcome. You're more than welcome to come join me if you want to lean against another side. Why don't you lean over here? You want to tap me on the shoulder? Let me know you're here. Do you do taps? I just footsteps above me. Um, right above me, but uh, there's voices so I can tell it's other investigators. I have to say without a doubt, from a skeptic's point of view, this place just carries sound. I'm not saying I'm a skeptic, but <laughs> voices are carrying, and I'm really curious to see where they're coming from. If, um, because right above here is just a staircase. So there's, they gotta be coming from pretty far. I literally have this thing touching my head. That was an interesting sound.
Wow, that's good. All right. One. One twenty-five. Hmm. <laughs> have this thing touch my head. Wow. Okay, there's two of those noises in a row now. All right. So, we'll hit record again, and we definitely caught some noise when I was standing over here towards this side. I am pulling onto the deer so I don't fall in this hole again. Okay. Got this on record, I believe. Okay, Ooh, cold spot, big time cold spot. Heater just went off again though. If that, that isn't just my luck. See those goosebumps? That's because when I was staring at the screen across, you can't see because of the light. When I was staring at the screen, I saw something behind me. Okay. Were my eyes playing tricks on me, or was there somebody behind me? I'm kind of stubborn, so I don't always necessarily jump to conclusions. I'm kind of a laid back guy. Monitor, see right there, uh, there is a reflection. I could see it now. Almost, yeah, there is a reflection. Uh, man. Look at this. This wall is falling apart. Uh, yeah, bro. All right. Thank you for watching Dead Explorer, real paranormal videos. Please make sure you favorite and like this video and subscribe for more Dead Explorer.